What up players, Warboss Tay back up in this mud. Welcome to my day 28 video for my Warboss Tay May Painting Challenge, challenge wrap-up in June. Today I'm going to show you the cultists that I painted up for the Party Girls Commission. So many Party Girls, uh, don't worry, tomorrow I'm going to show you something different. I'll do some iron hands, I guess. And uh, But today though, I wanted to show you the cultists that I painted because I'm really happy with how they turned out. And uh, specifically though, I want to talk about painting a, a topic that, that, that is near and dear to my heart. Painting hordes, or mass painting, your armies. There's just something about, about taking a bunch of models and, and slogging through them that is simultaneously soul draining, soul crushing, uh, extremely difficult. And, and it's just almost like not worth it. And then you get to the end and you look at it all together and it just it's the best feeling in the world, you guys. So I'm really, really happy with how it turned out. Let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Here's all 20 of them. You got 10 auto gun guys and you've got 10 auto pistol guys. Actually, no, you've got 8 auto guns, 8 auto pistols, 2 heavy weapons, and 2 leaders. So I'll face the camera here. Battery's running low on my camera because I've been filming these non-stop. Um, but I want to just say, you know, if, if you're painting a bunch of models all together like this um, and you're line painting and you have to get them done, like if you've got a, a deadline crunch or something, don't be afraid to, you know, take your breaks and, and not, not worry about the, the small details. The, the fun thing about this for me was that each of these guys was different. They were meant to look different from the others. They're all um, painted according to the box art, but they're all meant to look, you know, individual. And so not uniform. They look like a ragtag bunch of, of guys who, who got together and just decided to rebel against the Imperium. So each of them has, like, character and this, uh, distinct features that none of the other models have. I was really happy to um, be able to follow the the box art, but yet have some of my own artistic flair in it. So, for example, the the purple medallions that you see, the icons, that's all original. I decided to to do that as a homage to the Party Girls, because this is a part of the Party Girls commission. And uh, yet, the rest of them though looks very you know hodgepodge put together. So uh, you can kind of see that they're all a little bit different. I want to show you the two characters, though. This commissar was so much fun to paint. Let's see if we can get in a little bit closer. And see the detail there. I love the detail on the, the stock for his shotgun. It has kill marks. And uh, his mask was a lot of fun to paint as well. Okay, so there is him and the other leader guy right here. Really happy with how he turned out. Uh, stay tuned for more tutorials. I've, I'm already writing down a list of what tutorials I want to do, and um, it's going to be exciting. Hey, if you have any suggestions, please feel free to write it in the comments. Things that you want to see me build and paint up, I've I've got a bunch that I can do, and I'm looking forward to it. So, anyways, that's my little that's my little ramble and rant, and uh, that's everything for for today. Stay tuned and. Uh, in the next video, I will show off some Iron Hands Vanguard veterans. Alright, thanks a lot. Latest players!